Now that we've covered where to find AI Chat, let's dive into the basic functionalities available within it. When you hover over each icon in AI Chat, you'll see tooltips explaining their functions. Let's go through them. One, attached to AI. This feature allows you to add specific data to the AI's training to make it more tailored to your project's needs. When you click on this button, you'll see three methods for training. Text. You can input text to train the AI. URL. You can provide a URL to train the AI based on specific information from the web. File upload. You can upload files such as PDFs, audio, images, videos, and more to train the AI on that data. Two, AI model settings. This button lets you select which models to use while interacting with the AI. Pre-made prompts at the top of the text box, you'll find pre-made prompts specifically designed for filmmakers. These prompts help accelerate your workflow by providing ready-to-use suggestions. You can expand or contract this list as needed. Four, chat settings, three dots icon. In the top right corner of the AI chat window, you'll see an icon with three dots. Clicking on this will give you two options, clear chat. This option clears the current chat, erases the AI's temporary memory, and helps improve response accuracy and performance over time. Download chat. This allows you to save the entire chat history as a PDF. If you clear the chat, you can re-upload the PDF later to continue the conversation where you left off. Five, sending messages after typing your message, click the arrow button to send your question to the AI. The AI's response will appear in the chat box above. That's a quick tour of the basic functionalities of AI chat. In the next video, we'll explore how to get the most out of these features for your project. Thanks for watching.